In this video, we are going to talk about SmartThings versus Aquara, ultimate smart hub comparison. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. SmartThings SmartThings is compatible with a wide variety of different smart devices. Simply said, don't rely on the basic kit to serve as your entire security system. Right off the beginning, the SmartThings ecosystem can appear to be a little difficult. If you go to the SmartThings website, you'll discover that there is a vast variety of different devices and kits to choose from. It can be difficult to determine what you require and which items to select. For the sake of simplicity, we'll state it clearly. A Smart Hub is the most important piece of equipment for your SmartThings system. The SmartThings Smart Hub is the brain of the operation. It connects everything else and allows you to operate all of your smart devices from a single app, the SmartThings app. The SmartThings Smart Hub is available for purchase here. The SmartThings Hub is compatible with Z-Wave devices, as well as Zigbee and Bluetooth devices. One of the most compelling features of SmartThings is the sheer number of third-party devices that can be integrated into the system without causing it to malfunction. Ring Alarm, for example, has a significantly limited list of integrated gadgets than some other smart home or smart security systems on the market. The following are some of the features of the Samsung SmartThings Hub. It is compatible with Zigbee, Z-Wave, Bluetooth, LAN, cloud to cloud and Zigbee 3 wireless technologies. Supports wireless connectivity to smart home devices that are already integrated. Links to the SmartThings app, which allows for the creation of custom smart home rules as well as a remote control. Sends notifications to your SmartThings mobile app when certain triggers are met. It is compatible with Amazon Alexa and Google Home. Indeed, the SmartThings hub does not have cellular or battery backup, but this is a minor inconvenience. Essentially, if your electricity or internet goes down, your SmartThings system will not function. To ensure the effectiveness of your home security system, we do not recommend that you use the basic SmartThings hub and monitoring kit. Why should you choose SmartThings? SmartThings shines when it comes to home automation. If you want to start from the bottom up and create a super smart home system, SmartThings can be your best buddy. It connects everything and allows you to operate all of your devices from a single app, regardless of whether they are SmartThings devices. SmartThings enables you to create routines that make your life easier, while also making your home more intelligent. You can indeed purchase SmartThings branded sensors and light bulbs and set up a baby smart home setup. The main beauty of the SmartThings system though, is that it allows you to take all of your gadgets from all of their many manufacturers and program them to work together and follow complex rules and routines as a single system. Using the SmartThings app, you can create dozens of different rules or scenes that will cause several different smart home activities to occur at the same time. In the case of a good morning routine, SmartThings may automatically turn on all of your lights, play a song and start your coffee maker before you've even opened your eyes for the day, saving you time and energy. SmartThings is now compatible with Google Assistant and Amazon Alexa allowing you to do all of the same functions with voice commands. You may ask Alexa to do a variety of things, including turning on your TV, dimming the lights, and locking your doors. Cons Unlike other smart home apps, SmartThings can, for the most part, be used to operate your smart home devices instead of having to download and use them separately. However, it will not be able to entirely replace all of the currently available apps on the market. Consider the situation of people who have cameras. The SmartThings app does not yet support seeing a live stream from your camera, which means you will still need to have the Ring or Arlo apps installed on your phone to do so. Please stick to the end of the video to know much more and be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. Aquara Choosing the best DIY home automation and security system for your smart house can be a difficult task. There are several options available to you when putting together the best system for your smart home. One option is to select or choose devices that are interoperable with one another, but are manufactured by different manufacturers. Furthermore, you may choose a single manufacturer that produces all of the equipment you require for your smart home right now. If you decide to go with this alternative, Aquara is a manufacturer that you should take into consideration. For this purpose, they sent over several smart gadgets, including their G2H camera hub, to be tested in an actual residence. The Aquara Camera Hub G2H, an Apple HomeKit compatible hub that also acts as a camera and a Zigbee hub, will be the focus of this review and we will share insights into each device as well as findings from testing each one. 
What is the Aquara Home Automation System and how does it work? Aquara is a manufacturer of smart home devices and solutions that are well designed, reasonably priced and simple to use. Smart sensors, switches, curtain controls and smart door locks are among the devices available by this company. These devices are managed by their smart home hubs, which can either be a standalone hub or a camera hub depending on the application. All Aquara hubs are compatible with Zigbee 3.0 and can control a total of 128 Aquara devices per hub. Besides being compatible with Apple HomeKit, the hub also functions with the Siri, Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant voice activated systems. Specifically, we examine the G2H camera hub, vibration sensor, temperature and humidity sensor, as well as motion sensor for this review. Regarding the Aquara Camera G2H Hub, you will appreciate the fact that there are no monthly costs for video storage. We were able to store videos locally on a micro SD card thanks to the Camera Hub. The advantage of saving videos locally is that you can capture in-view films even when there is no network connection available. If on the other hand you prefer to keep videos in the cloud, Aquara has a solution for you. Because they are Apple HomeKit compatible, you can choose to save videos in your iCloud account if you so like, if you have one. When engaging with the Aquara app, we had the impression that we were dealing with the Apple HomeKit app. Its look, as well as its functions, are quite similar to that of the HomeKit app. Aquara does allow you to set up automation via the Apple HomeKit app, but only if you have an Apple TV or HomePod acting as your hub. The Aquara app will need to be configured if you wish to add automation, notifications and alarms for your devices that are controlled by Aquara. Why should you choose Aquara? If you wish to create a custom solution using smart devices from several manufacturers, Aquara is not the right choice for you. However, if you are looking for an all-in-one smart home system that will ensure that all of your gadgets are compatible, Aquara is an excellent place to start, especially if you are a fan of and user of Apple products. Aquara gadgets are inexpensive, and they provide a large number of smart devices that may be used in conjunction with one another to make your house smart. There are no monthly fees or expenses associated with this service. The hubs are available in a variety of shapes and sizes, giving you a choice in how you want to control all of your devices. Furthermore, they are simple to set up and integrate with Apple HomeKit devices. Cons of Aquara When compared to other smart device apps, this one is not as user-friendly to operate. However, if you can discover the proper mix of Aquara hub and devices, you will be able to overcome the difficulties associated with using their app and create a DIY intelligent home system. Also available is the option to create and manage the best DIY smart home security system at an affordable cost. Something to consider while putting together your own DIY smart home system. So we think SmartThings is best because the SmartThings hub supports both Zigbee and Z-Wave. It can connect to thousands of devices, far more than many other hubs. Furthermore, the SmartThings app is jam-packed with features that allow you to build a variety of different situations for all of your home's electronics. Most importantly, SmartThings now integrates with Nest gadgets, making it a true smart home hub. What do you think of our video? Comment on your favorite part of the video. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more home automation videos, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.